Hi guys, welcome back to Eat Your Kappa with me, Nambi. In today's video, I am going to show you how to smoke meat. And using this method, you can smoke any meat of your choice, be it pork, fish, mutton, or even beef. As some of my viewers had uh, asked how to smoke meat, this is how you do it, and now you can smoke your meat. Well, that was a joke. Smoking is injurious to health and it's a really bad habit. But smoking meat is an awesome process and you should do it. If you plan to smoke meat, make sure that you choose boneless meat. Since I have fresh beef with me at home, I am making use of it. You can work with any meat of your choice. Meat as much as you want that you would like to store. Wash the meat properly and cut them into long strips. You can even cube them if you like. Don't cut the meat too thin, otherwise when smoked they will shrink and look like thin wafers. Have at least 1 inch of thickness. Our meat is ready, now let's spread it in a bamboo tray and hang it over the fireplace. You can make use of any kind of bamboo tray and when you are hanging it over the fireplace, make sure that you hang it at least for half a meter distance because it will be too close to the fire and it will burn and your meat will be ready in the next 2-3 days. Hanged it over the fireplace and the meat should be ready, all smoked in 2-3 days. This is what becomes of the meat after being smoked for 3-4 to four days. It has lost all its moisture content. It has a smoky smell and it develops a smoky flavor and uh, it has a long shelf life and you can store it for months. I forgot to tell you about these bamboo trays. These are actually traditional rice sieves that we use to sieve our rice and it's not only used to sieve rice but also to smoke meat. It is made of strips of bamboo and it comes very handy to smoke meat. We just place our meat and put it on top of the fireplace. If you do not have bamboo trays such as these, you can make use of uh, rods where you can hang your meat over the fireplace or uh, thin strips of metal wire where you can just tie your meat up and hang it over the fireplace. As most of the villages in Northeast, my village is also pretty remote and we don't have the convenience of going to a convenience store and buying our things, our groceries. So whenever we go to the market, we make sure that we buy it in bulk and I have smoked uh, pork as well. So take a look at it, it looks really beautiful. <laughs> okay. 
By using this method, you can smoke literally any meat. You can smoke your pork, beef, fish and even mutton. And uh, chicken, I'm not really sure because I think chicken gets over in 2-3 helpings itself. And, uh, uh, and for those of you who are living in cities, I'm sorry I don't know any other method how in, wherein you can smoke your meat. However, my mum has tried it once, uh, smoking, uh, ha making, uh, hanging uh, these trays over a gas stove. But it took ages for it to smoke and it does not have a smoky flavour. So uh, perhaps you can uh, order your smoked meat from a traditional northeastern store. And uh, that's about it. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. And I'll see you in the next video with more amazing recipes and interesting things from the northeast. Don't forget to like, subscribe and share.